This is an entire box of Amazon returns, but not just any Amazon returns. These are Pokemon card products. And as you guys know, Amazon will literally let you return things for any reason. They have the audacity to send this back in a Ziploc bag. Did I say they'll let you return stuff for any reason? Because they will. These are all resealed. So today we're going to see if these returns are still brand new in the packaging. There's scotch tape all over it. No. Or if little Jimmy decided to open every single pack and then just return the energy. Oh no, they're all open. Again. Dang it. This should be interesting. Let's crack it open, so let's take out some of this stuff and then just randomly grab something out of here. And let's go. Oh, okay. Let's go with this. No, no, I'm already nervous. This is a build and battle box of brilliant stars, but there's scotch tape all over it. No. Oh my god. Okay. And by the way, you could tell this is actually an Amazon return because they always have LPN, some bunch of numbers on the bottom of it. Um, I know that's what they do because I've seen it before plenty of times. But yeah, so this is... Oh no. Dude, you can, you can hear... I, I don't know. Maybe maybe there's packs. Maybe they're still sealed. But here's the thing. Again, remember, you can... Like, most of the time people return stuff on Amazon. Like, you can, like, literally just return stuff. So that's what I'm really scared about. But all right, let's cut this open and we're going to see what we got in here. Just so you guys know, I got this from a company that I do business with that I purchase, like, Pokemon products from. They're like, hey, we get, like, a bunch of returns in and we have a bunch of, uh... Pokemon card returns from Amazon. Would you want to just have them and like open them up in a video? I was like, yeah, that'd be cool. Cause they, uh, I guess they get them for cheap because it's returns and they never know what to expect. Just like I have no idea what to expect. <laughs> oh no, it's gonna be. Wait, why? Why? Ugh. How do I open this? Oh my god, it's because it's literally taped at every angle. Whoever returned this did not want it to be opened up. I feel like. I still can't get it. Oh, okay. This should be the last piece. I promise. I think. Oh my god, I lied. There's another piece right here. Okay, okay, okay. Oh my god, I can't get this open! Okay, uh, you know what? There's literally like 50 spots where there's tape on here. Finally, we got it. Okay, let's reveal what's inside of this. Oh, and really quickly, I'm going to show you what's in there. But before I do that, I want to let you know that I'm giving away another Scarlet and Violet base hit booster box to one subscriber. If you'd like to get the giveaway, all you have to do is number one, smash the like button. Number two, make sure you subscribe to the channel with notifications on. And then number three, leave a comment down below in the comment section. I'm nervous. I'm so nervous because it could all just be bulk or a scam. But here we go. Oh my god. See, that's what I was afraid of. I was, this was exactly what I was afraid of. Oh my God, bro. They literally rubber banded. <laughs> if the pulls are gone too, this is going to be even worse. Okay. But that's all right. We're, we're, oh my God. It's a legit, like they literally put the rubber, they put the rubber band in. Anybody ever, anybody ever do this thing back in, uh, back in school? Boop. Okay. So we have like this little insert thing here, but, uh, try the code card. No idea. If I'm, I don't know if it's still going to work, but let's see if there's actually stuff in here. Oh, wow. They actually left in the book. The pre-release card is still in here. Okay. But let's see what we actually get inside of these. Because if you guys know, you get a bunch of energies. You get like a little mini deck in here. Uh, but then you also get booster packs. So that's what I'm curious is like, if they open the pack, did they take the hits out? Or did they leave them in here? So we're going to be looking for rares. There's another code card. They might work. They might not be. I don't really know what this person did. Again, you have no idea what to expect. Oh, we do have a hollow rare in there. So that means they didn't take that out. I, if I could see like a V-Star or something, then we'd know for sure. But right now, I don't know yet. Uh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to say like who opens up an entire build and battle box and then just returns it. Maybe an Amazon customer, I guess. I don't know. There's another code card. Could very well already be used. There was a reverse there. They left the hollow in. Okay. There's a rare non-hollow. They might have actually... Well, that's actually... I don't know if that's from, like, the deck that you get in these things. But they might have... I don't know. We'll see. We, they might have left them in there. There's another one. It's right after the reverse, too. They might have been honest. No, you know what it is? They might have opened it up, and they were like, I didn't get any hits out of this thing. I want my money back. Or, like, they thought they got scammed or something, maybe. I don't really know, but you can like, yeah, maybe they thought they got scammed because honestly they didn't get any hits it looks like, but it looks like this person was left everything in there, the pulls, I think. All right, this is, this is cool. I've never done anything like this before, so this is going to be interesting. I don't know. Um, I want to see if there actually is anything sealed that somebody returned. They just changed their mind. Super honest person just left it sealed and returned it. I don't know if that's actually going to happen though, but anyway, let's do the next thing. Oh, it's vivid. It's more tape! No! We have a vivid voltage. 
Elite Trader Box that's been through some stuff. This Vivid Voltage ETB has been has been through a lot, and you can tell it's seen everything that there is to see at this point. This person sent this back, and uh, they literally taped it up again. But this time they they upgraded from Scotch tape to to normal tape. But again, see that LPN thing down there, or L yeah LPN. That's a that's a return. That's like that's an Amazon return or a store return in general. But it's definitely it's it's an Amazon return for this. All right. I'm just going to be here cutting open tape for the next 10 minutes. Yep, still just sitting here cutting this. No big deal. Don't have anything else to do. And are we free? We might be. Let's see if it opens up. Okay. So, what do you guys think is going to be in here? Uh, this question. If there's sealed packs in here, this could be pretty sick. Because it's a bit of voltage. Oh, no. I see cards. I see... Oh. Oh, no. They're all opened again. Dang it. Yeah, this is not looking... Yeah, this is this is not looking too good. Um, we got our sleeves here. They left the sleeves. They didn't even bother with the dice. They didn't want. They want nothing to do with that. Um, are those sealed packs in there? That I don't think they are. Oh my god, this is gonna be bad. Let's just let's just take them out. They're empty. They're empty. No. <laughs> they put the empty packs in there just to just to like a little extra like. Oh my god. Well, there's a code card again. I, I don't know. They could have just used the code cards, too, for all we know. Okay, let's start with this side. Now, again, the question is, if they did open it, did they put the hits back? <sighs> let's see what happens. All right, so with these things, you do get energy. So let's skip right through the energies for the most part here. Oh! They left it in! Dude, they didn't take the hits out! Oh, my God! They were an honest person! I can't believe they left this in here! Dude, they could have easily took this! All right, I don't know. I, I, <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. Dude, they actually left a solid card. That's a Pikachu VMAX. All right. What is coming up here? I see a bunch of black border things. Are these all code cards? All right. Don't know. Don't know. Just try it if you want. Sorry if it doesn't work. There we go. What else did they leave in here? Shame and Hollow. Okay. They're leaving everything in. They said, forget it. I just don't want to do I don't want this anymore, Amazon. Give me my money back. Yeah, that's the thing with if you're a, a Pokemon card seller on Amazon. Pretty, it's pretty risky, I feel like, because like again, you have to do Amazon's return policy, and they say that you can return it. You gotta take that return. I love some cards in here. Hang on. All right, that should be all of them. Let's see what else we got. There was a V Max. Is this gonna be a person that just wasn't happy with their hits? Like, what is the reason that you return this? Were you not happy with the hits? Um, like, what's the reason? You know? Sometimes I feel like it is that. It's either people are just like not happy with the hits. They're like, oh, I didn't get anything. I want my money back. Or they're like, I didn't get anything. This was a scam. Get my money back. I don't know though. Let's see. They did get the Pikachu V Max. Maybe that's all they got, and they were like, Nah, I'm so, I'm so mad right now. But like, I don't know. All right, that is the other. Okay, yeah. Surprisingly, this is our first real big card from this video. Is they left the Pikachu V Max in there? All right, I'm searching through this. I feel. Oh my God, is this sealed? Hold on, this feels sealed. I'm not looking, I'm not looking. This feels sealed. I'm still not looking. Oh my god, it's a build and battle box. Dude, this is sealed. If this isn't sealed, I literally have, I, I, it has to be. Oh! Oh my god! Somebody sent back a sealed fusion strike build and battle box. And it is, like, dude, I'm telling you, this is a return. These are the stickers they put on here. Yeah, this is like the UPC underneath of it, where they actually label the product, and then this was like, if it was returned, that goes, that goes on there. That's wild, wait. There's no way this is resealed, right? It feels like the original shrink wrap. There's no way somebody would go through that much effort. This is Fusion Strike, though. If we hit it big on a return Fusion Strike box. All right. That was, that, that was, okay. Let's, let's just see. A little squished. But what's the reason? They changed their mind. They made it. It was a little squished. Oh, my God. That's legit. That's legit. We just got something huge out of this thing. Okay. Wow. It was actually sealed. So we do have the Deoxys as well for the pre-release card. That's amazing. I'm not going to go through this whole thing in here, but yeah, that's a great card. All right, let's continue. And oh my God, dude, we got four Fusion Strike packs. Legit. They're legit. Let's go. Wow. I didn't, I honestly was like, I, I didn't know if we were going to be opening any packs in today's video whatsoever. Because like, again, with Amazon returns, it's so like, I feel like it's so weird how they do stuff. Um... Yeah, and like you could just return it. It's weird. I mean, yeah, I don't know. They track all that stuff though. Electrode. That's wild. Okay, if we get a big hit out of this, that is gonna be nuts. Let's keep going here. 
Let me know if you guys are enjoying this video, by the way. It's always cool to be able to do some new stuff, um, especially in Pokemon cards, uh, because, like, I've never done this before, and it's, like, just really, it's really kind of just crazy to see what stuff and how stuff gets returned. Toxtricity, we got a hollow pull. I don't know if you guys have ever seen, but there's some people on YouTube that'll do, like, a huge return, like, skid or, like, a palette, you know, like, a palette thing of returns from Amazon. Um, I wanted to do that originally, but it is, like, impossible to get that for Pokemon cards because they just mix a ton of different things together. You'll get, like, electronics, board games, toys, maybe some Pokemon cards, like, a million different things that I don't need or want. Um, and, like, I just want Pokemon cards because that's what we do, Pokemon cards. And uh, I don't think I could ever find a skit of Pokemon cards like returns like that. But you never know. We got Maractus. All right, let's keep it going. Fusion Strike, baby. One more pack of this, and then we're going to dig back into that returns box. There's still plenty of stuff left in there to see. Uh, so you never know. We might hit it big, man. Somebody might have just been like, I don't want this amazing gold card pull. I don't know. Maybe. Taco Demoro and Eladios. All right. Can we stay that lucky with this stuff? Can we stay that lucky and get sealed stuff? I don't know. Oh, no. <laughs> ah, no. What? Bro, it's a Ziploc bag. They had the audacity to send this back in a Ziploc bag. Oh, my God, yo. This is actually what? Okay. Like, what? That, is, <laughs> that is a return of an executor box. Whoever got that thing was probably, like, did not want that at all. Oh, man. Okay. They went through the trouble of sending it back. They even put it in all in, like, a Ziploc bag. Perfect fit. Look at that. Oh, man, this is going to be bad. Okay, well, the good thing is they did send the Jumbo promo card back, which is a good thing. It's a little bent, but they at least put it in there, which is a good sign that maybe there's a hit in here. But I always have a feeling that if they put the <laughs> Wait, this is a different product. This is like two different products mixed together. This is the back of uh, one of those tins. But you get this in the executor box, right? Okay. I don't know what to expect here. This could all be energies for all I know. All right, let's see what we got. Dude. The Ziploc bag is what got me. There's actually reverse. Gyarados. Okay. Um, the, Pokemon Go. And they have that tin thing there for some reason. I don't even think they know what they're returning at this point. They're just like, I don't want it. Give me my money back. Just throwing stuff in here. But this is all Pokemon Go. non hollow so far. We have the reverse Gyarados. Oh, I'm trying to see. I didn't check. I should have checked on the other ones if it was any rares. Oh, no. They might have They might have took all the rares, guys. This might be what we were afraid of. Oh, no, no, no. Hold on. We got one. That's one. That's two. That's three. They didn't take the ho the rares out. I don't think. Oh, my God. Okay, so it's all they. Yeah, this is somebody that was like... It's just mad with their returns, dude. I feel like some people get mad that they can get what they want. All right, what else do we have? Um, what is this? All right, I'm not going to look. I'm just going to throw it on the table. Battle League decks. Okay. Oh, my God. And it's opened? Dude, they were... Okay, so this is something where I feel like... I feel like with this stuff, people might buy this. Maybe maybe like a, like a kid or mom for the, for the kid or something. And they don't realize that there's no booster packs in here. So they're just like... I just bought this for fifteen or twenty dollars or whatever, and I didn't get any packs. Give me my money back. <laughs> That's how everybody says. Give me my money back. Let's see. Okay, so this is all set up like I guess like normal. Yeah. So there's that. I think this might actually be fully untouched to be honest with you guys. Yeah. Um, this might be. Yeah. This is all like the deck, the dice, all that stuff is in there. I think this is pretty much untouched. And then you get your V. There should be a V, which is a million of these in the world. The V Maxes, and um, yeah, I think this is like, they just were like, no, 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 like, I, I don't know what this was. There's no packs. I want to return it. Oh, no. Oh, this could be the worst of all. Oh, my God. Wait. Ah, <laughs> no. Oh, my God. This might be the worst of them all. This looks terrible. Oh, they didn't even bother putting any packaging back. They just threw them all in a bag. Dude. This is horrible. This looks like my Pokemon cards from when I was a kid. They're so messed up. This is going to be bad. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. Hang on. Oh, 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 no. Okay. It's all energies, and they're all messed up. Is it all energies? Oh, my God. We, this might have been, a, like, a scam. This might have been a scam, because what product has just energies in it, guys? Seriously. What product has just energies? None. None are... What happened to this? 
Oh my god, these have been through tough times, I could say that for sure. Is it all energy? Oh my god, dude, this was like, this could be an Amazon scammer where they just were like, yeah, I'm gonna return this product I got here, and then they just send it back and it's all energy. Yeah, it's all, it's all energies, isn't it? It's all energies. This right here, probably the biggest scam of them all. Like, this person literally just sent this back. Are you kidding me? This is getting ridiculous right now. All right, let's keep going through our Amazon returns box here. Um, is this a build and battle box? I'm not going to look again. You guys can probably see it. And, oh, no, this is opened, isn't it? Fusion Strike, but it's open. No. <laughs> it's not taped, though. Let's give it a shake. It actually doesn't sound like... It doesn't sound like that the cards are loose in there. These might actually, we might actually get some more packs today. I, I won't get too excited, but I honestly feels it sounds like it's, dude, this one's crazy. So whoever returned this took the plastic wrap off, and just said this is not for me. <laughs> Give me my money back. <laughs> Ow, my. Oh no, wait, wait, no. Oh my god, dude! No! They resealed them! This is all resealed! Oh my god! That one is... That is by far the biggest... That beats the other one! This one's even worse! Dude, this is... Like, this is what some people do? Oh my god. This is like... Dude, they tried to reseal this. This is just kind of like sad to see sometimes. I don't know. This is kind of like... Ugh. This is like weird to see. I, I don't know. I feel like even weird showing this kind of stuff because it's just like, it's like bad for the hobby in general. I just don't like this kind of stuff at all. Especially like if it's like a local card shop that's trying to sell stuff on Amazon and then there's like people that are just literally scamming them for their stuff. You just don't want to see this kind of stuff. But it happens. It probably happens more like so much. Like this dude literally took this out. I didn't even mention this, but this is supposed to be a pre release card on the front here. This is just a reverse. So they took one of the reverses from these packs, put it in the front. They took out the pre-release card. Uh, I think they took some stuff, more stuff out of here too. I'm going to assume this person used this code card. Okay. But this is the worst part of it all. These are all resealed. What did they do? What did they do? Oh, it's like taped. Oh. This is, oh, oh my God. Cause like imagine if this got out to somebody that actually purchased this and it was like oh, there it is the rare is missing this is what i was afraid of oh man that is like so weird that they did this that they went look that's tape that's tape this is all tape right here or glue no it's tape look it's like oh, maybe it is glue glue or tape they must have opened it like this. Yeah, that's taped there on the top. They just taped, they just like taped it back to make it look like they never opened it. And like, there you go. A hollow is missing there. I'm gonna assume these don't work, judging by how this person did this. They didn't even bother taping the bottom of this or they tried and it came off. Yeah, look, see, that's, that's tape. Oh, okay, here it is. You could tell. It's so weird, man. Oh, scammers everywhere. Look, there's the tape. And they just taped it like that. Like, at first glance, I thought this was legit. But because this, the wrap was off of this, you had to have thought, like, why would they take the wrap off and then not touch anything else? But clearly, these are all... This is, like, the worst of, like, the hobby that you could ever see. It's, like, when you find something like this, say, like, Amazon put this back in stock. They didn't... They were like, oh, yeah, it's new. Sometimes that happens. Something gets returned. An employee has to look at it. And they have to say, okay, is this in new condition or is it has it been opened? They might trick an employee and be like, yeah, this is still open. this is still uh, sealed. They put it back in stock, and then somebody else ends up with it. So it doesn't, it harms, it could harm other people buying stuff too. And it's just like, yeah. All right, anyway, let's continue going through our returns box. And uh, feels like we got a couple more things here. Let me see. I think, okay, this is going to be the rest. Yeah. What is up with this? There's like a, oh, this was a UP. They literally, sh <laughs> they literally shipped this. With like like this. This is how they shipped it. No box. You can, there's a UPS label right here. This is probably how they returned it. They, it was like, okay, label your product. They just put it around the thing and they, they're like, that. There you go, UPS. Give me my money back. Return this. Um, 
I'm gonna assume that, yeah, this is the same thing. I does we don't even need to look. I mean, I guess we could look at it real quick, but we're gonna this is gonna be the same exact idea. Somebody purchased this and they were like, I didn't know there was no packs in here. And uh, yeah, they didn't want it. I, I, that's what I would guess. I feel like that probably happens more often than a lot of things with these. Cause uh, yeah, there's another one. Same thing, probably opened it up. There's no packs in here, mom. I want something else. But yeah, that's our returns. We, we did open up four booster packs and we did actually get um, one cool card or two actually because of the pre-release. But thank you guys for watching the video. If you enjoyed it, make sure to smash the like button on your way out. And if you want more content, click on one of the two videos at the top there. Hit that subscribe button as well. And as always, I hope you have a great day and I will see you on the next one.